Welcome to Dine About It. Dine About It. We're dining and about it. Yeah. Boy. I'm really hungry. I was pissing me off. She's actually so grumpy. I'm being really grumpy. Um, today's Dine About It is a five-star restaurant. Everybody loves it. Um, most people maybe haven't experienced eating inside of their exquisite seating room. It is... In and out. In and out. We're having In and Out today. I'm very excited. I like In and Out. My my headspace going into this is it's going to be good, and I'm going to like it a lot. And I'm going to get a vanilla milkshake. I think it's really good. I haven't had In and Out in a very long time. I have some traumatic stories to tell about In and Out. Oh. Um, and I don't eat uh, fast food very often. I get fries often. I drive through and get fries at fast food places, but I never really eat fast food. So. Do you get anything off the secret menu? No. Yeah, guys, I know about the secret menu. That's I'm special. Nerdy. I'm gonna get animal fries with no sauce. Sauce. Anyway, we're going in. Yay! In and out, where the burgers run about. In and out, in and out. That's the song. That's the song. The in and out song? Yeah. I please don't mind my outfit. We're going to a photo shoot after this. She looks I don't cool. Like this, but I, look like a... oh. I don't think we're gonna be able to film. Well, we are gonna be able to film. What do you mean? Right? We're just on a freaking cell phone. No. Maya's getting nervous. No, not like oh, they're gonna say. She we hates can't our film job. Here. I just there's she's a lot embarrassed. Of in there. There's a lot of people, but there's so many empty tables, and we're gonna be cool, and people are gonna be like, "What's your channel?" And I'm gonna be like, um, Dude, "But we look so annoying." You look, look annoying. Look at you. Look at you. Ew, we look so annoying and like influencery. Cool. I'm just on the set. I'm FaceTiming my friend. Hey, mom. What What do you want from In and Out, mom? I'm asking. I'm FaceTiming. It's crazy that you chose to FaceTime. Mom. I shouldn't have. I should have chosen any other family member to FaceTime. Wow. I'm gonna get a T-shirt. Wow. She's getting. She's ordering already. We didn't even discuss this. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. Um, good. I'm with her. Sorry, I'm panicking. I don't know what to get. I'm FaceTiming my friend. I'll hang up. I'll talk to you later. Sorry, I got to order. We're back. It says touchless. Touchless. You put your finger in the middle. Whoa, technology. Guys, exciting news. I got a shirt. And Maya paid for it. I did pay I could have paid for it. I have to get water. I got a water cup. Cause I got a milkshake, touchless. Oh boy. Oh, okay, it's harder than it looks. <laughs> okay, all right. And Guardian Leviosa. <laughs> what, I'm doing my best. Oh, I got it. We touched it. ACO water. This is so hard to watch. <laughs> ACO, ACO water. I'm just using the wrong spell. That's good enough, thank you. The guy asked where I was from because of my accent. Because she goes, can I get a cheeseburger with no sauce? <laughs> no sauce, and was, please. And I was like, yeah, I'm sorry. It sounds like she's from the East Coast, but she's not. And she's like, I have a speech impediment. <laughs> yeah, I have a speech impediment. The guy was shaming me, honestly. Um, okay, tell him what we ordered today. I got a hamburger, Cutie got a cheeseburger, we, I got normal fries, she got animal style fries, I got a Dr. Pepper, she got a vanilla milkshake and water. And she got a large t-shirt. I got onions, she got grilled onions. I feel like I got so much food that I'm gonna get fat shamed in the comments. And instead of fat shaming me in the comments, skinny shame Maya. Wait, huh? <laughs> Please. <laughs> I, I beg you. I'll take it. Anyway, here's some water, you guys can have some. Um, we'll set a timer to see how long it takes for them to give us our food. <laughs> what number are we? They're yelling 32. Oh, shit. Um, they're ordering. They're yelling. They're yelling so many things. What number are 34. we? 34. Oh, 34. It's been 17 seconds. 8 to 19. Seconds go by fast, honestly. I think it's gonna be several minutes. Several minutes? Yeah. We'll see. Great news, they have called number 34. Three minutes and 57 seconds. This is the fastest any restaurant we've ever done dine about. It has gotten our food but also the only one that we've ever set a timer for. Wow. Yay. 
yummy. Oh, that's a lot of sauce on yours. Wow. That looks like enough calories that I can't eat anything else today. <laughs> oh my god, shut up. I'll never, I'll never shut up. It's my job to talk, actually. This is actually. you, this is you, this is me, this is me. That's me. That's what Josh said. As a fry? I'm gonna be honest. And not fries are. Whoa, try mine, they have cheese on them. <laughs> You spit so much right there. What? You did like one of those squeeze out spit out of your side of your mouth thing. Oh. Play it back in slow-mo. No. <laughs> They're better. Mm-hmm. Well. They're still not good. Here's some B-roll that you can put some funky tunes to and we're gonna eat. Please put music over it. Halfway through the burger check-in. How are you feeling? in and out burgers are so much better than normal fast food burgers, but I am going to remove a tomato. Whoa. But I'm going to keep the other one again. I think, though this one is different than like all the other restaurants we've been to, I think it's better than TGI Friday's. But it's better than TGI Friday's. <laughs> TGI Friday was the worst. But it counts as casual dining because they have bar stools. So far, seven out of ten. Seven out of ten. I got French fries. Yum. Animal Normally, animal style has sauce on it, but I hate sauce, so I got no sauce. You're trolling when you say it like that. No, I'm not. Say it normally. Say it sauce. Sauce. There you go. That's fine. There's some sauce. No. <laughs> My voice just sounds so deep. Rate the fries. Um, they're cold. Mm -hmm. And so the cheese, since it's plastic, has created a really hard layer where you can touch it and nothing happens. <laughs> so that's cool. Yum. Do we get fries anywhere else ever? Um, Chilies. No, I got vegetables in place of my fries. I don't think I got fries everywhere. I don't know. Well, and then their best fries out of any place we've gone. Yay, dine about it. Oh my god, the service. What are you guys doing over here? We're good. Right. Thank yeah, you so thank much. You anything? No. Wow. That's better than Applebee's, I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I hate Applebee's. We murdered it. Actually, you did worse than I did. Uh, don't show them that. Sorry. I'm on a diet. I'm eating them. Great. I didn't finish my burger either. I, it was just bread. I don't really like bread. I keep telling myself I'm going gluten free and I keep forgetting. Why are you going gluten free? Um, because I'm getting acid reflux again, and last time I went gluten free it went away. So I might just have to be gluten free for a few months. Anyway, this was good. I've got my t-shirt. I'll put it on in the car when we do our last review. But Maya has to give you a tour of the bathroom. Maya's bathroom review. Okay, welcome to the bathroom. Okay, there's no one in here. Um, so far... So far it's fine. Eight, eight out of ten. Yeah, this is my in and out shirt. For $14.99. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Thanks. Maya bought it for me. Yeah, she's gonna wear it for the photo shoot. It'll be sick. I'm gonna look wicked. Wicked. Um... When we left, the, the lady worker opened the door for us and said, have a nice day. And that was very nice. It was very nice. And she also, as we left, I saw a sign that said that their french fries are cooked in sunflower oil. So that's cool to know, too. I was singing when we walked up to the car and the car next to us, he's okay, has his window down. And I was singing and I walked in and I realized his window was down. He's right there. It's a little uncomfortable. He's leaving because he's, 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 oh she's God, saying he's like, so she's bad. So weird. He left. Um, so it was fun eating it, but right now I feel awful. Oh my God, we both feel terrible. I actually feel so nauseous. It was so good though. But now I... But I guess that's how it goes. I don't want it again. I don't want it I'll again. never eat it again until like next month. 
Yeah. Um, okay, well. Wait, do you want to know my traumatic story? Yeah. When I was little, I had a sheep and mm -hmm. uh, it got a fox tail stuck in its eye. Ow. And, um. So you took it in and out to feel better? No, we were uh -huh. taking it to the vet, but it was like a bunch, it was a bunch of hours, uh, drive. And we were just going to get the fox tail. The sheep was fine. She was like, whatever. Um, and we drove through or we went, we stopped at in and out on the way to get food to eat in the car on the way to the vet. And uh -huh. we went inside, we got food, we came back out. And when we came out, um, the sheep was dead in the trunk. Because it, I guess it was some sort of bacterial infection that developed that we didn't know about. And uh, she died. And her name was Brownie. And for seven <gasps> years, I didn't eat in and out because my child brain thought that in and out did it. I was like, it's just because... She probably just died because we ate it in and out. Yeah. Um, but I thought that it was in and outs fault. So I didn't go to in and out for like seven years. Rest in peace, Brownie. Yeah, it was actually really sad. Do you think if you didn't stop at in and out, she would have lived? No. Well, she was gonna die on the way there. At least you got your burgers, it's just, I guess. It's coincidental. That's really sad, and you should always take foxtails in the eyes seriously. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna go now. We're gonna go do a photo shoot. Oh, we're supposed to rate. We're supposed to do numbers. Mm. Taste, presentation, creativity. Uh huh. Taste. Um. Overall, uh, seven out of ten. I really like In and Out a lot. I never get it, so it's like a special thing. For presentation. Me. I'm about it. Six out of ten. Cool, but you can eat it in your car, which Applebee's does not have that option. True. I had a six and a half. It looks pretty good. Presentation. I, I like the way they package it. Creativity. Their menu is actually not very good. I was going to say creativity is probably like a two out of ten, which but is if, a good thing. But they have their stupid secret menu, and that's cringe. I think they're not very creative, but it's kind of my favorite thing about it and not is you literally have three options. You go, I want it, want it, whatever. They're not creative, but it makes it easy. I think they're the fastest food that we've had because they are similar to a fast food chain. For sure. But definitely casual dining, like all the other ones. It is absolutely a fast food chain. Well, Maya, Dine About It only does casual dining. 